All right, this is uh, Luke at his sister's house, uh, packing up to get ready to head out, because um, I've stayed at my sister's house since uh, Friday, and yeah, I just didn't feel like recording anything at all, because uh, you try uh, you try recording on a slouchy couch that, like, leans in like this for uh, an extended amount of time, and I can't just, like, stand still like this and play the game as well. And, uh, plus, uh, this is where I've been sleeping. I, I don't, uh, sleep on, like, my sister's bed or her, uh, children's bed. That, that, I, I don't feel comfortable with that, even though, uh, my sister has said, uh, Feel free to sleep on my nephew's bed. It's like, it's a rather normal bed, but yeah, I just don't feel comfortable doing that. Um, I don't know if you all can hear a little bit of background noise, but um, that would be, if you can, that would be uh, my sister's fan. Why, why do I have my sister's fan going? Uh, this entire, okay, there we go. Uh, this entire weekend, uh, she told me on her, uh, note that she left me that I needed to leave the, uh, temperature in her house at 76 degrees during the day, during the day, and about 72 to 73 it can be at night, which... It's only three days. She can't spend an extra 10 to $20 on her electric bill for that. She's even, she's even buying a new house that, uh, that, in my opinion, she shouldn't be getting because they'll just go more in debt. And, um, yeah, pretty much uh, me, my mom, my dad, and a few other people that know about it don't think she should be doing it, but... She's doing it anyway. Plus, she's on a trip right now, so that tells you all something. <laughs> um, okay, so I got the whole, uh, got that whole thing straightened out where that's why I haven't recorded anything. I do have, if you noticed on my channel, I, I'm going to try to edit my channel a little more from now on, but that's if I have the time, which <laughs> you know me, I don't have that much time. Um, I'm going to, like, either edit the playlists that are on my main channel, or, uh, if you noticed at the very beginning of this video, um, something popped up right here, if you have annotations on, that would be, uh, that would be, like, my current video that I want to get everyone to watch that previews something, which right now it should be the, uh, Pokemon X and Y announcement that I made, because, um, yeah, that's a little bit of an important video to uh, watch, especially for people that are new to the channel that don't know about what I'm going to be doing, and just watch, like, for example, just watch uh, one Animal Crossing video for the hint and cheat, like, Lots of bells on the island, or a uh, glitch, or something else, and uh, want everyone that's uh, coming to the channel to know that I'm going to be doing X and Y either, and I even looked into it a little more. Let me see if I can pull up the page. Uh, language. Pokemon X and Y. Um, yeah. Okay, I think I might have found a place where it shows the, uh... Okay, maybe I didn't. Um, pretty much, there's a screenshot somewhere. Okay, 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 okay. Here, here we go, here we go, here we go. This is the screenshot. Let me just, uh, screen region it. This right here is the screenshot of Pokemon X and Y, if once you get the game. 
Um, I'm pointing the wrong way because my camera should be the other way. But as you can see right here, uh, Pokemon X and Y, you can select each language from Japanese to English to lots of other languages on that list. And that's going to be apparently in every single version of the game. However, if you like get, it, let's say, the Japanese version of the game, it'll probably only appear as Japanese characters on, uh, on the list instead of like how they should have done it where you have like English and English, Spanish is Espanol, Japanese is the, uh, Japanese are the, I think, three characters that appear and so on and so forth. They should have done it like that. Kind of like how I remember Super Smash Bros. Melee, uh, if you try to change the language on there, it would have English in English and then Japanese in uh, actual Japanese characters, not English, like not in English. So that's how they should have done it. So that way, if you're playing this, like for example, if you're playing this in Japan and live in Japan, but um, Japanese is your second language and not your first, while English is your first language, uh, then yeah, they, that would have helped a little more, I guess you could say. But either way, what I'm going to do for Pokemon X and Y, uh, look up what English is in Japanese right before the game comes out and uh, buy it off the... Uh, Buy it off the eShop if uh, I don't get the download code. If I don't get a download code. If I do get a download code, or, yeah, if I do get a download code, which I will probably be sending uh, Nintendo a another message tomorrow, either tomorrow or today, uh, whenever this video goes up. If, it go if this video goes up on Labor Day, then it'll be uh, tomorrow. But if it goes up on, uh, if it goes up on Tuesday, I'll be sending it today. Um... But, yeah, if I get a download code from Nintendo, I'll probably buy the Japanese import as a physical copy. But otherwise, uh, otherwise I'll just download it because I'll already have the game. And, uh, yeah, because, as you all know, a physical copy is better to have than a digital copy, especially if you're buying from Nintendo, because Nintendo doesn't want to do their whole uh, have an account then uh, then you can support up to like three to five systems with set account because uh, unlike uh, PlayStation Network, which does allow you to support like up to five consoles, I think, for, for that stuff. But eh, what can you do except try to tell that to Nintendo and they refuse because for some reason, I don't know. I don't know why. I mean, just just link it up to your Club Nintendo account. Like that's what they can do. Just link up all the games that you download off your Club Nint onto your Club Nintendo account, and then have like up to three to five systems on the Club Nintendo account, and then everything would be great. Yeah, that's that's what I was thinking. Um, okay, and I feel like. Well, I'm going to talk about some more stuff in another video that I will make at this house um, still because I still got like an hour and a half. Like, I could leave in 30 minutes, but I'm going to be slow packing whatever else I have to pack up. So I'm going to leave in about an hour and 30 minutes But um, as of making this. But, yeah, I'll make one or two more videos. One's going to be about fan art for the channel and... Uh, what you all think about the idea of, like, if you notice on the Hatsune, the Project Diva videos, um, let me see, uh, let me, uh, let me get a picture of Project Diva. Where, where, where's the, where's the thumbnails for Project Diva? Where? where? This is the longest. I should definitely remove some of these. Uh, um, okay. So, 
here's part of Project Diva's uh, thumbnail right here. Um, as you can tell, it has art in it, and uh, it, like right here, and uh, that wasn't made by me, it was made by Oreo, and uh, have her name in the description on, or have her name in her uh, Tumblr and her, uh, and the actual, uh, the actual art uh, in another link, and... What I would do is, if you're an artist and feel like either making a thumbnail, making art for a thumbnail while I put it like how I did here where I put the game's title and background in the background and then put uh, Luke on the side over there. And uh, if you feel like making art, I already have someone that's probably going to do uh, Pokemon X and Y as of right now maybe. Uh, but, um, I mean, for example, if you want to, uh, if you want to do something for, like, Legend of Zelda, um, Boktai 3, uh, any other games that I got planned, uh, or are doing, I can switch up thumbnails at any time if you want to do, uh, if you want to do a thumbnail for me, I I don't mind. And then you get like, uh, at the dog just bumped the the thing holding my computer. Um, pretty much, uh, if you have any kind of artistic sort of thing, uh, feel free to PM me on this channel and subject it art or fan art or whatever you want to do thumbnail. Uh, those three, like those three topics, will probably get my attention on my uh, on my PMs. While anything else, like, doesn't come in to play as fast, like such as 3DS friend code addition or anything else that's uh, anything else that's like that. <laughs> um, well, like, let me see if I can use an example. Um, which, by the way, Google Plus sucks when you ever, ever you get it connected on here. I got that disabled immediately. Um, I did help someone. Well, hasn't really been too many people uh, being annoying on my PMs too much. Because, uh, <laughs> yeah, like one of the people I helped out with XSplit, like trying to tell them about XSplit, my recording program I use and stuff, and yeah, but, um, pretty much, uh, yeah, if you have any artistic capabilities where you can make thumbnails or fan art or anything, that will be explained in another video, but I'm just giving you a heads up, because I also got something else to talk about in fan art, but I'll talk about that in the next video that I make for an update. Um, what else? Let's see, the video's about 15 minutes long, so yeah, I, I'll cut it off here. Um, hope you all enjoyed the video, and, uh, yeah, that's about it. Like, I would say leave a like, but this is an update video, and once this goes, like, once this becomes, like, two weeks or more old it's not going to be that important anymore anyways even though it does have some important stuff in it um but yeah with that hope you all have a great day and i will catch you all next time actually there is one other thing that i gotta say uh before i actually end the video now that i think about it <laughs> um it's like some people think that I only play, record videos and games and stuff like for the channel and not play anything my off time. But however, um, I have played a few games on my off time. Uh, and one of them that I'm starting up now, you all are going to hate me a little bit because I probably should be recording it. But yeah, I want a game that I can play on my own. <laughs> um... 
Here's my micro. Oh yeah, that is a lovely micro, isn't it? And if you can tell from the back, that's the game I'm playing. If you don't know what game that is, then uh, you're you're pretty young. <laughs> um, but yeah, this is the micro. If it'll do any zooming on it. Come on, there we go. Oh yeah, it's like my favorite system. It even uh, whenever you uh, whenever you uh, turn it on or anything, it can. Well, I don't think you can hear it. Nah, you probably can't hear it. But whenever you turn it up, it makes a beeping noise that reminds me of the old like cell phones or whatever. And uh, then you can also like change the brightness on the screen by I think uh, what is it um. Is it like select? No. No. Forgot what the. Okay. It's the L button, I guess the R button too, and you can change the brightness by just turning up the volume or turning down the volume. So yeah, now you can read it, and now you can't because I got it right for me. <laughs> um, but yeah, uh, playing through Pokemon Leaf Green before the game, uh, before Pokemon X and Y comes out. So I have some Pokemon, some Pokemans of my own. I can't believe I just said that. Um, but, yeah, that will be the end of the video. And I uh, hope you all enjoyed again. And, yeah, this is the game that I'm going to be going through with my little tiny micro that's uh, very small and probably one of my favorite systems because it's so portable and has, like, one of the best screens for uh, for the old Game Boy Advance games because... Smaller screen equals better resolution of the game, and better, better resolution of the game means crisper graphics. And that's why whenever people are like, Why is the screen so small? I go, I, I think to myself, because it looks better. Um, yeah, that's my little uh, rain on the micro. <laughs> Anyways, again, catch you all next time, and I hope you all have a great day.